Yeah, I'm having a real battle here. I would challenge anyone, anyone to come in here and try to do this trail. My goodness. Not only is it long, a lot of it is swamp and underbrush and trees down across the trail. Not just one tree, multiple trees, bushy trees. Oh, I just was, I was going by the seat of my pants there for a while. I didn't know where the trail was, but uh, I, I saw it again here. You can see it again through the sort of a bare path through the bush here. And once again, the, the birches help. You can see a corridor going through the white birches. I looked at my map again, and I'm still, yeah, I, I thought I was going to be closer to, to Black Lake, but I wasn't as close as I thought I was. Yeah. I'm going to be missing lunch, that's for sure, because to get back out of here is going to be just as much trouble as coming in. Holy moly. I don't know when the last time anyone did this trail was. Oh, but... Yeah, if you want a challenge, <laughs> here it is. <sighs> I've known people that went into Fullerton Lake, but that's fairly easy. Once you get past Fullerton, all bets are off. Son of a gun. I'm beginning to wonder now if I'm gonna make it to Flack Lake. Cause this trail is actually meant for people who want to camp overnight in here. So they have all day to get in, they camp and then they can come out whenever they want. Huh. I can't stay on the trail because there's too much overgrowth, undergrowth or whatever, branches, no leaves, but lots of dead stuff and across the trail, it's, it's a pain. Yeah, last time I looked at the GPS, I was still on the, the right trail, so I'm not concerned about that. It's just the, the amount of work, you know? Yeah, I gotta have enough energy to get back out of here. But you know, when I can see the trail ahead of me, I don't wanna stop. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, son of a gun. Turn the video off. I'm gonna waste my battery.